Today I am in Midland City Cemetery in Midland, Michigan. I want to tell you guys a story about five souls that were lost to a house fire in May of 1974. It was May 15th, 1974. This is Mills Township, Midland County, Michigan. And the family was all gathered together and they were planning a wedding in the coming days. Their uh, daughter was to be married on May 20th and uh, the family was all gathered. They uh, had put the children to bed and some of the adults were still up talking about things here and there. And uh, back in those days, something that was very common was wood heat. Um, someone went over and stoked up the fire and opened up the damper to the wood stove. And uh, a while later, one of the older folks that were still up went up the stairs and they found the, one of the bedrooms fully engulfed in flames. Now, the newspaper story says that the children were sleeping separate. They had the girls in the east bedroom and the boys in the west bedroom, um, which will be kind of relevant later in the story. So the newspaper article says uh, a 26-year-old Midland man and his four cousins he was attempting to rescue died in a fire that destroyed a home in Southwest Mills Township Wednesday night. The victims were Dale Church, son of Mrs. Charlotte Church, Sherry Lynn, five, Tammy Louise, 10, Joseph Ernest, 11, and Dale Allen, 13, children of Mr. and Mrs. Ivan Church of 2152 Schaefer Road, about 10 miles north and west of Midland. Mr. and Mrs. Church and another daughter, Marilyn, escaped from the burning home. While the fire broke out about 10.55 p.m. Wednesday, the last of the five victims was not removed from the ruins until 1.47 a.m. today, which was the next day. All five bodies were found within a 10-foot radius of each other in an east bedroom of the second floor of the old wood frame residence, causing deputy sheriffs to speculate Church and the four children had made an attempt to escape but had been trapped at the top of the stairway. First, Church and his uncle and aunt made an effort to put out the fire or cool it off in order to reach the four children but were driven out of the home by the heat and smoke, deputies reported. Then the father attempted to gain entry to the second floor by climbing through a window but was driven back by the flames, officers said. Dale Church reportedly ran back into the house, upstairs through the flames. Ivan Church told the officers that was the last time he saw his nephew alive. The fire was discover discovered by Marilyn when she started upstairs to go to bed. At that time, the entire second floor was engulfed in flames. A report of the fire was received by the Sheriff's Department on the Hope Township fire phone at 11.05 p.m. from Robert Inman. Hope Township firemen were dispatched to the scene and when they arrived found the entire residence engulfed in flames. At their request, the Mills Township Fire Department was sent there at 11.19 p.m. and the Larkin Township Fire Department at 11.27 p.m. The last of the firefighting equipment did not clear the scene until 2.42 a.m. today. Ivan Church expressed belief to deputy sheriffs that the fire started from sparks in the attic after someone opened the damper on the wood, wood or coal burning stove. Loss of the dwelling and contents was estimated by firemen at $10,000, none of which was insured. While the fire was brought under control by 1150, the ruins had not cooled enough to make a search for the victims until around 12.40 a.m. Right here in this spot is the resting place 
of all five victims of that fire. Dale Allen, Joseph Ernest, Tammy Louise, Sherry Lynn, and Dale Lewis Church. The obituaries read, Dale L. Church, 26, died in a fire which also took the lives of four of his cousins, members of the I Ivan Church family. Mr. Church was born December 3, 1947 in Cleveland, Ohio, and came to Midland in 1971. He lived at 2152 Schaefer Road. Survivors include his mother, Mrs. Charlotte Church of Midland, one brother, Charles Jr. of Midland, and one sister, Bernadette, at home. Four children in the family of Mr. and Mrs. Ivan R. Church of 2152 South Schaefer Road died early this morning in a fire which destroyed their home. Dead are Dale Allen Church, 13, a seventh grade student at Jefferson Intermediate, who was born on January 10, 1961 in Midland. Joseph Ernest, 11, a fifth grade student at Siebert School, born September 15, 1962 in Lansing. Tammy Louise, 10, a third grade student at Mills Township School, who was born April 15, 1964. And Sherry Lynn, 5, born March 1, 1969 in Orlando, Florida. Besides their parents, survivors include their grandparents, Mr. and Mrs. August J. Pitt of Midland, and Mr. and Mrs. C.J. Tigner of Sanford, great-grandmother Mrs. Neola McFarland of Weberville, several aunts and uncles, six nieces and nephews, one brother, Jerry of Averill, five sisters, Mrs. Becky Inman of Midland, Connie of Midland, Deborah of Freeland, and Diane and Marilyn at home. Buried over here about a hundred or so yards from the church children is Charlotte Priscilla Church, the mother of Dale Lewis Church, the hero that ran in the house to save his cousins and died in the fire. Now, Charlotte's husband, Charles Manley Church, died in 1970 before they moved here to Midland and he is buried in Brunswick, Ohio.